Watch you guys today we're taking a look at how to reset your Synology NAS admin password without losing any data. So here we have our Synology NAS right here. I've got a couple of them on here. If you open this up and you've forgotten your admin password to log in or your user password to log into your device, then I'm going to show you how we can reset this without losing all of the data that you have on your NAS. Now this is quite important because obviously you need to gain access to your NAS to take back control of your NAS. So if you've forgotten your password for your NAS, then don't worry, I'm gonna show you how we can reset this. Very simple and easy to do. So what we have here is first go over to find.synology, make sure the ready status is on for your NAS, and also make sure it's online and turned on. You can then head over to the synology.com website and do a search for your NAS. Inside here, you'll get all the information you need, like desktop utilities, if you still can't find your NAS, you can always use the Synology Assistant to do a search for your NAS on your local network. You can either do this for Windows, Mac or Ubuntu. You can see here, download the software. Once you've got Synology Assistant open, do a search and it should find your NAS right here. You can also search inside the Network tab and do right click and go to Properties on your NAS and it will give you all the information you need right here to let you know that your NAS is ready and it's online and ready to be reset. If you head over to the download section as well, there's loads of documents on here about your NAS. Make sure you're searching for your particular NAS and it will give you loads of information about how to reset your passwords and do loads of other stuff here. There's plenty of uh, documents over there. So now we're at the back of our NAS. You can see here it's on and it's working. Right next to the ethernet cable, you will see a reset area here. Just make sure that you put a little tiny pin or a clip inside here and uh, you don't want to be poking it anywhere else. Just go into that reset area right here on the screen. I'm just going to be using this little clip here. You can get a, a little uh, paper clip or something like that, bend it back and you should be able to poke this into the hole. So let's go ahead and click inside the reset area. Here. You should feel a little click, hold it in there for about three or four seconds and you should hear a beep coming on the actual NAS. Once you've done that, head back over to your login page for your NAS, type in admin and leave the password area blank. Push enter and this will allow you to gain access to your NAS. Now we're not quite there yet because we are using the admin account without a password on it, which means it's wide open uh, to everyone. So I'm just gonna skip all this uh, security stuff here and set this up a little bit later on. Uh, but what you need to do here is once you've done all of this and click OK, it's going to take you to the reset password section. Now you can enter in your new password. You'll see that the user account that we was using previously is showing up here. If you had the admin account enabled, the admin account will be enabled here and you can then put in a new password. So I'm going to put in a strong password here for this account. And once we've done this, we're going to apply this to our NAS and this is going to be our new password. Make sure you write this sort of stuff down in some sort of password manager and you should see success. And now we can sign in to our NAS properly. Now we've secured our NAS by giving it a proper username and password. So sign in with your new details that you just created during the reset process. So I'm going to put in the username here. And once I've done this, I'm going to click next. And then what we're going to do next is put in our password. So let me go ahead and paste that in there. In the site, stay signed in, and basically that's now given us access to our NAS. We're fully back to the where we was, so I'm just going to quickly skip this for now, and I'll take you straight to the control panel where you can gain access to your user account, which will be your main account here. Uh, let me just go ahead and do that right now, and this will give you an opportunity to set up all of your security stuff. So let's go ahead and click on the control panel right here. And this will then allow us to go to users and groups, click in here, and you should now see the admin account was disabled and so was the guest account. And we had that user account, which we've just reset. All of the data on this NAS is safe and it's not been deleted. And this is probably the quickest and easiest way to reset your password on your NAS if you've forgotten it. You can change password here again if you wish. You can also add your email description and loads of other information like permissions and other things all inside this uh, location right here. And that is pretty much it. So if you've locked yourself out of your NAS, 
This is how you can quickly reset the password without resetting all of the NAS back to default settings and losing all your data. It's very quick and easy to do. So I hope this video helps you out. My name is Ben Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Just want to say a quick shout out to all my YouTube members, whether you're tier one, tier two or tier three. I really do appreciate the support and I shall catch you in the very next video or I'll see you on the Discord server for a chat. Bye for now.